Hi, this is Sarah Marks, one of the librarians here at UMass Lowell. For this video, I'm going to show you how to use the database Education Research Complete. This is by the same company that created and manages our ERIC database, but the difference is what's in them. This is a research collection, not including those ERIC documents. And it includes some of the titles that might be in ERIC, but some art article titles and journals that aren't in ERIC. So it's important to search both. For this video, if you want to see a more in-depth look at how you can use this company's databases, the ERIC video is the one to watch. But for this one, I'm going to quickly show you some of the options that are unique to the Education Research Complete uh, collection, and it'll be a very brief demo. So again, I'm going to do Special Education in one box, and in the next box, Autism. I'm going to scroll down, I'm going to limit myself to those scholarly peer-reviewed articles. Notice I have the option to limit to full text and references available. I would suggest not doing either one of those. Your date range is here, as is your publication type, your language, and document type. If you want a cover story, or a, you can limit that way, I would ignore the image quick view and the PDF full text because full text is important. You want to really just get the articles that are best for you, whether they have full text or not. Interlibrary Loan is a great service to get the articles that we can't just get immediately in the databases, and it's really fast. So I'm limiting just to those scholarly peer-reviewed journals, and I'm going to run my search. Now I might have some of the articles I found in ERIC, but I might have different ones. If I scroll down, I have my options for date range, source types, the source terms, and a second subject terms. They're two separate but connected. They're just different ways of describing something. You can use either. Publication, language, geography. So if I want to make sure that my research focuses on the U.S., or maybe a specific state within the U.S., I can do that. And you can see that there is one that talks about Massachusetts. So this is an option that's here that's not in ERIC. And so that's the very basics of using Education Research Complete. Again, if you want a deeper look at looking at the articles, getting the full text and the citation, you can look at the ERIC video that will explain all of that. 